Lately, a lot of girlfriends have been noticing that their boyfriends are thinking a lot about ancient Rome, but I just wanted to show you how much I think about ancient Rome. Look, empires, maps, imperial Japan, ancient Greece, ancient Egypt, a statue of Hatshepsut, but none of those things are Rome. So let me show you just how much I think about Rome right now. I think about the Roman Empire so much that I bought this $200 massive wall print of a Thomas Cole painting. It's the fourth painting in a five painting set. The fourth painting depicts what we call the Heights of Empire, a glorious period where everyone is celebrating. What are they celebrating? Because the leader is returning from battle. This is the Caesar figure, the dictator. He embodies the moment, but the moment won't last and neither will he because he's probably gonna be assassinated just like Caesar. And now if that doesn't happen, don't worry because the empire is still gonna fall. How do we know? There's a little hint. Empires always fall in the womb. These two young princes, wearing green and red, are fighting, one with a blade. Soon, one of them will kill the other, and the empire will fall. That's in the fifth painting, so you'll have to stay tuned. They are brothers, we know that. Their mother is over here. Oh wait, their mother's not here. Oh, that's because I only spent $200 on this painting, and that's what happens when you only spend $200 on a print of a famous painting. Now. Coming down the steps of a gigantic temple is the priesthood who are gaining in power, pulling power for themselves as an interest group. Backing up here, we have this uh, Roman goddess. Uh, this temple up here is kind of Persian-ish. A lot of things in this painting are just a mishmash. You'll notice different types of columns like Caryatid columns, Corinthian columns, Doric columns, Egyptian papyri columns. Gotta look up the name for that one. Thomas Cole has combined different architectural styles from across many civilizations and put them in. Up here in the top right hand corner of the painting we see the distinctive mark that all Thomas Cole paintings have in common. A rock that stands out on a precipice. Each of the five set have this. It's the one thing in all five paintings that doesn't change. Thomas Cole, a famous, famous painter of the Enlightenment period. This was a period in which uh, our founding fathers were looking back upon the past to see what could be in our future. This is not a real place. You cannot go here, etc.